Just a few years ago, WKU canceled their varsity men's soccer program. But that doesn't mean the boys don't play. Let's go! Led by a new coach this semester, the team is starting to turn around. I actually want to start to play for the team. Uh, we had a few pick up, uh, pick up games on South Campus, oh sorry, South Lawn, um, on the main campus, and uh, Chris actually came up to me. Uh, Chris, who's the vice president, um, and asked me if I wanted to coach. And it just so happened that I am fully qualified to coach um, anywhere around the world. Notice the accent. Coach Rob Bondi hails from Liverpool, England, and he has quite a soccer history. I started start at a very young age um, and kind of played to, you know, just recreational leagues. Um, when I was quite young, uh, I was 12 years old, I played for um, the Everton Youth Academy um, and then kind of got injured. Uh, so that didn't really work out as, as well as the ones of the two anyway. Let's go, let's go. Talk about credentials. Listen up, lads. I mean, I do love playing, but at the same time, I love coaching. So, um, as you can tell, it's a very course. I'm very um, passionate about coaching, and I'm very involved in everything that's going on. And the players definitely appreciate it. Having a vocal coach is very important. Um, keeping the players motivated, like I said, and really on task during the training sessions, and being able to make smart selections and substitutions during the games. I, was, I used to play here, and I barely came to practice at all. So last semester I wasn't motivated, but this semester is like everything is actually in place, more organized, players are coming out and playing and... Motivation, effort, winning. Or in Rob's case... Let's go! Um, I tell a lot of the guys, I hate losing more than I like winning. Nonetheless, with Rob's guidance, the team continues to make strides. Reporting for The Extra Point, I'm Tyler Poe.